And as Blake was mentioning, Firebirds fans are definitely fired up for the game. News Channel 3's Kenji Ito continues our Firebirds coverage after visiting a local business that is all about our Coachella Valley team. With game one between the Firebirds and Bears underway, not only are the players excited to hit the ice, but also the fans. Super excited for these boys. They've worked super hard. Really excited for them to take game one. As the birds are away for games one and two, local businesses like the Playoff Sports Lounge are benefiting with the birds on the road. They've been a great community partner in a lot of ways. I mean, they've come out here for activations. They've uh, supported us with stuff to give away, t-shirts and things like that and giveaways. And it's just a local thing for people to do and get behind. So we're really behind it. CV being in Hershey until June 16th, the birds are helping grow businesses that don't get much spotlight here in the valley. Well, being from Desert Hot Springs, we're a small town. We're kind of on an island out here. So it's always nice to be able to invite the rest of the community to come out, see us, and understand that Desert Hot Springs is more than they might think it is. We've got some great places to visit out here. As there's no watch party at Spotlight 29 Casino, bigger crowds are expected to show out to watch the hometown team play. Well, honestly, I mean, Spotlight has the has the viewing parties for their road games. So we don't necessarily get a huge crowd, but we get a very dedicated crowd that comes out here that can't get all the way to the other side of the valley who wants to come watch the games here. But tonight, we're expecting a bigger crowd. Not only is it the finals, but unfortunately, Spotlight's not able to do it tonight. So they're advertising some of us locally. In Desert Hot Springs, Kenji Ito, News Channel 3.